In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to use the Trim and Extend tool in Risa Floor. This model, we can see we have a skewed section here, and for some reason we're going to be adjusting our project grid in a way that we see it disassociates the members from here on the left side and extends the members past our, our beam here on the right side. So we can use the Trim and Extend tool to help us create a better model here. So we see we have two icons here. One is for the extend the member and one is for trimming the member. If I click on the extend member, I can scroll down and close into this section here that I want to extend. And what is important here is that I click on the portion of the member I would like to extend and then the icon will change and I will click on the member I'd like to extend it to. So I can see then it changes the icon one more time. So I can continue to extend as many times as I want. So just click on the end of the a member and the member I'd like to extend it to and I can continue clicking. When I'm finished extending all of these members, I can just right click and the drop, I drop the tool. I can do a very similar thing on the right side here where I click on, instead of extend, I click on the trim the member and I need to click on the member I'd like to trim, which is this portion right here, and then the portion of the member I'd like to trim it back to. So I can see I click it back there and I extend, it trims it back. Now it's important that you select the portion that you'd like to, to uh, trim to. For example, if I click on the, this portion here, this is the other side, and I choose to trim it back to this, we'll see that it's going to trim it back in the opposite direction. So I'm going to undo that and I'm going to click it one more time appropriately on the portion I'd like to trim here and then click it back to the portion I'd like to trim it back to and I can continue all around. So once I'm finished trimming I just right click, drop the tool and now I'm, I'm completed editing my model.